How to update to TWRP version 3.6 with partial Android 12 support on the POCO F3 or the Mi 11X. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can update your TWRP to version 3.6 with partial support for Android 12 on the POCO F3 or the Xiaomi Mi 11X. Now, what are the prerequisites for this video? Well, for starters, you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have TWRP recovery already installed. Next thing you need is to be on a ROM which is based on Android 11. If you are on a ROM, which is based on Android 12, then you will have to use the fast boot method of booting into TWRP and then installing TWRP. Video for that can be found in the description of this video. Next thing, why do I call this a partially supported TWRP for Android 12? That is because it decrypts data if and only if there is no pin or password set in android if you have any pin or password set then it is not able to decrypt data but if you do not have any pin or password set it is able to successfully decrypt data you are able to flash your roms and keep your twrp recovery as well now all the files which we are going to use are linked in the description of the video and you need this file now do note this is an unofficial build but to me personally it really doesn't matter whether it is official or unofficial build as long as it works without any issues so this here is the image file which we are looking for and right now i am running linear Lineage OS based on Android 11. Next thing we need to do is we need to boot into our current recovery and then once we have turned off our device then you need to press and hold power and volume up together till you see the POCO logo or the Mi logo. Once you see the POCO logo or the Mi logo let go of the power button keep volume up pressed and at this point you should boot into your TWRP recovery or team win recovery. Now do note I am running the official build right now so this is 3.6 but this is for Android 11 and that is the reason why we need Android 11 if you want to update from your phone directly. Next up we will go into the advanced and then here you need to select install recovery ram disk this is going to open the file manager application in your internal storage then you need to navigate to the folder where you have the new twrp in my case it is in the download folder because i downloaded the file on my phone directly all you need to do is select this file which is for android 12 and here in swipe to install that's it it is going to backup and then install it you know at backing up boot it might seem that it is stuck but do not panic just be patient everything is going to be absolutely fine now once the flashing process has finished successfully we can go to the home button go into reboot and select system why are we booting into system i'm trying to show you that there are no issues with booting back into your current operating system once you have installed this new unofficial android 12 partially supported twrp for the poco f3 or the mi 11 x and there it is you can see we do have the lineage os boot animation and pretty soon we should boot into lineage os without any issues next up if I now turn off my device and then follow the same process of pressing and holding power and volume up together and once I see the POCO logo or the Mi logo I will let go of the power button there it is POCO logo let go of power button volume up is still pressed and here it is BAM we are booting into the new TWRP and this of course might be from a Chinese developer for the redmi k40 because that is what it says on the top but nonetheless it works absolutely fine on android 12 and here it is i am able to access my android 11 internal storage as well now when you open the twrp recovery for the first time chances are it will be in chinese how do you fix this tap on this second icon from the bottom right so this one over here tap on this and now tap on the last icon on the top so this icon over here and this is our language menu here and select whatever language you want to let us select english and then tap on the option on the bottom right this button and bam here it is the menu is now in english so just to prove to you that the recovery works absolutely fine on android 12 here it is 
POCO F3 Mi 11X running the official build of a ROM called CAF Extended. This of course is Android 12 here and if I go into settings and then if I go into security. The only drawback of this recovery is if you set any pin or password it will not work with Android 12 as in you will not be able to see your internal storage but if you do not have any pin or password set device here you can see encryption and credentials says device is encrypted and next up let us go ahead and turn off the device and once the device has turned off press and hold power and volume up together till you see the me logo or the poco logo once you see the logo you can let go of the power button here it is i saw the poco logo let go of the power button volume up is still pressed and you can see we are booting into the twrp recovery which is compatible with android 12 and if i go into install the touch drivers do take some time to load so you do have to be patient let us try it one more time here it is you can see i am able to see my internal storage without any issues and there it is peeps that is how you install or update your poco f3 or the mi 11x to a twrp recovery which is compatible partially with android 12 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you